G'day folks. I'm just troubleshooting this pump that was given to me by V8 Jagnut. He was going to chuck it in the bin, so I figured I'd have a look at it. He said it was seized up, and sure enough, the motor shaft was seized. I think the front bearing and seal has leaked, and it's just rusted up. I broke it free with the ratchet, and it runs quite well. Very noisy, though. It's going to need tearing down on new bearings. It's a pretty sizable motor, though. It's worth keeping, even if not as a pump, just as a normal motor. Made by Davy Products Australia. The Powermaster 250 silicon carbide seal. <laughs> Probably done a lot of work and just perished and leaked. Strainer and everything in it. Green stuff. <laughs> make a good water pump anyway, even if I need to buy a seal kit for it. Give it a shot. Yeah, she's a bit noisy. Probably not meant to run without water either, but since I've got to buy a seal for it, it doesn't matter. I'm going to strip this thing right back. The one problem I found with this uh, pump, and I can understand why my mate didn't want to pull it apart very quickly, is the uh, aluminum oxide is built up around the threads of these bolts so bad it's just pinched them into place. I broke this one free with some very strong blows from a hammer and a lot of WD-40. These other bolts came out alright, but because this is on the bottom, near a weak point, uh, the aluminum's just oxidised to the point where it's locked the stainless steel bolt in. So you've just got to beat the crap out of it with a big hammer. Yeah, she'll come out. Give it more time. I'll let the uh, spray soak in a bit better. Must be to do with the stainless steel as well. They seem to create some sort of uh, anodic or other reaction between the two metals. Well, that one will come out. Well, they got that apart. You can see the uh, impeller right here. This the impeller. impeller rotates. It draws water in through this end here and discharges out through these slots. I was hoping it'd be one of the aluminium ones. I used to uh, work at a foundry that made the aluminium impellers and discharged and suction housings for these pumps. They actually made a lot of parts for the bigger pumps. All in sand cast or die cast aluminium. You can see the oxide build up on these bolts. Almost looks like Loctite, but that's just aluminium oxide. It's not supposed to be there. Uh, I've just got to find a way to get this impeller off. I assume it has a, like a left hand thread or something on it. Unscrew it and just try and see what it'll take to get it repaired and working again. Paint's well and truly shot. Need a good clean up, respray. It'll be a saleable pump. Thanks for watching folks. <laughs>